In this module, I will be talking about talk as transaction. Talk as transaction is the function of speaking. In talk as, as transaction, the most emphasis is on the message rather than the participant. Examples of talk as transactions are many. For example, class, classroom group discussion and solving problem. A class activity through which students are designing a poster, discussing needed computer repair with a technician, discussing sightseeing, sightseeing with the hotel clerk or tour guide, making a telephone call to get a flight information, asking someone for direction on the street, buying something in a shop, ordering fruit from a menu in the restaurant. The main features of talk as transactions are it has a primarily information focus. The main focus is on the message rather than the participant. Participant employs communication strategies to make themselves understood. There may be frequent questions, repetitions and comprehension checks. There may be negotiation and digressions. Linguistic accuracy is not always important in talk as transaction. Some of the skills involved in using talk as transaction are explaining a need or intention, describing something, asking question, asking for clarification, confirming information, justifying an opinion, making suggestion, clarifying understanding, making comparison, agreeing or disagreeing. Talk as transaction have the most important part in our daily life. In the classroom practice, we needed it not only be because we are delivering knowledge, but it's mostly information focus. So whenever we're teaching them in, in the classroom practice, we have to be coming up with, with a lot of explanation and descriptions. So it have to be plotted of a question, a clarification and confirmations in which students can do debates, they can discuss issues that are concerning of their familiarity with, with the informations of the knowledge, particularly for spoken, uh, spoken discourse. Therefore, let me, let me sum up talk as transaction is a sort of information focus rather than sort of focusing on the participant. It, in it, we are describing things, we are explaining things, we are trying to analyze things, in which we go through asking questions, repetitions, and so on and so forth. So it is important for classroom strategies that we can use lots of strategies in which we can let students know talk as transaction is an information focus rather than focus on participant.